Good bloody beer morning. Welcome. Off to another hit camp. This is Paperbark Creek. Um, it's in Bindoon. It's probably about 45 minutes from my place. Pip, say hello. Got me mate Pip with me. I've just met the host. He's pretty cool. His name's Pete. Um, <laughs> bloody nice bloke. <sighs> yep, I'm about to set up. Um, I'll do a little bit of laps on that. And when I'm all settled, I'll show you the camp. This is pretty cool. Um, it's got like a little um, creek over there with a little jetty and all that. So there's heaps of water in there. So I'm pretty keen to check that out. Um, other than that, the place is pretty dry. I'm, I'm spewing. No fires yet. It's coming. Bit of humidity up there. So here's hoping for a little bit of rain. That'd be nice. All right. I've got to get this camp going. Good bloody goon afternoon. Hey, check out what's coming. Now, I just heard on the news that they reckon there's a chance of showers, so... That's pretty cool. Oh, I can see old Pete over there. Hey, Pip, how you doing? Anyway, all set up. <clears throat> uh, here for two nights. Um, hip camp in Dune. Um, I've only got some simple dinners to do. I'm going to do a salmon tonight, a marinated salmon. And then I've got steak. Uh, nice and easy. Um, I think I'll save all the good stuff for next time. I'm just going to go for a walk down to the little dam, lake, whatever it's called, spring, um, and see what's down there. Pip's coming. Coming for a walk, eh? Hey, gal. Good gal. All right. See you when we get down there. Stop recording. Stop recording. The uh, property owner's had this place for about 20 years. Um, he comes from up north. There's six bays here, pretty evenly spread out, a little bit of distance between each camp. And he's got two powered sites up there behind the house there, so um, we all follow the fence line here. Looks a bit creaky in there, there's heaps of reeds and whatnot in there, so must get a bit of water coming through in the rain. Pip's enjoying the outdoors. No butterflies here though, is there, Pip, eh? It's looking pretty grey up there. I'm pretty hopeful we get something. It'd be nice to sit back and have a little bit of rain. Too bad we can't have a fire. Well, I guess Andy better be careful. <laughs> oh, God. Check this out. Swim at your own risk. <clears throat> Old mate went in here before, reckon he went in there this morning. Says it's pretty cool. How nice is that? Little bridge over there. He did tell me there's a few bees cruising around here, obviously after the water, so I'll just watch me step, I think. And I'll be hive. <clears throat> So that's the little jetty there, um, you can swim in there, that's the other side over there, that's it, where that little chair is, and old mate Pete was saying he's got a four inch pump there, so he sets it up with hoses and all that and he runs it out there, so if there's ever a fire around here, the helicopters and all that come down and they um, come and grab his water. Um, I'm getting a bit nervous because matey mates over there. I might head back. Pip, come on. You look thirsty, mate. Hey? Too bad you can't carry your own goon. I can only imagine how many's in there. <laughs> mm. Hey, Pip. Pip. Let's go back, mate. Come on. Good gal. Check this out for endurance. 
tree falls over and he's still going and he got chopped up to make clear for the path how good is that <laughs> To show you the camps, um, that was this is camp one, it's quite large there. It's a little bit of a breeze happening here, so I don't know if that's affecting the mic. Might have to do this again. So, a little bit of room in between. So, this is camp number two. Poo -poo. It's pretty sizey. You could almost share a bay, eh? Two caravans in there, easy. Looks like someone's just recently left here, number three. Not bad. There's a fire break there, that's where I was walking before towards the uh, dam. Bit of um, firewood stock. One day it's happening, it's coming. It's coming. Bay four, a little bit smaller. Still two vans, easy. Reverse in, drive straight through. Bay five, it's pretty cool. Not much shade here, but plenty of room. It's a little bit of a slope here. And then I'm in Bay 6, which is down here. This is pretty small. Camber trailer, I reckon. Caravan. That's all you need. I just wanted to be right at the end. And there's two powered sites too, which is down the other side there. I didn't really work out where they were, but they're there. There's a map on Wikicamps too, which shows you all that. Um, I don't know if we're going to get a bad ass. Look at it. Oh, such a long time coming. It's so dry. Oh, good girl, Pip. Do you have a drink? Yeah, good girl. Good girl. All right, well, I'm gonna sit back, relax, have a few sherbets. Might even think about getting dinner. Oh no, it's only, it's time. 1.34. I've got new glasses. And I've got a new screen on my phone and they've, whatever the screen they've used, I can't see it with my Polaroids. It's no good. Anyway, I'll probably see you at dinner time. I'm going to sit back and chill. Oh, I can hear a little grumble grumble in the air up there. I actually uh, just checked Facebook and uh, the weather maps and they reckon that like June Love got smashed and there's rivers down the street. So, uh, yeah, let's see how Andy goes. Does he get a wet ass? Oh, but we need it. We need it, don't we, Pip, eh? We need some water, mate. We need some rain. Hey. Yeah. Yeah. Keep you posted. Well, it's starting. Starting the rain. <laughs> Starting the rain, Pip. What's that? Awesome. Not sure how long I'll be saying awesome for, but we need it. <clears throat> Good bloody goon evening. Hello, Pip. How <laughs> you? You come out of your bed, have you? been an interesting day actually weather wise a um, little bit of rain but it's not really penetrated but 
been doing didn't get that much night is still young i guess um just getting dinner ready uh tonight i've got some salmon um and i'm just doing these um tato gratins with my little side shift button so got some potato gratins in there and these are like stainless steel tubes that you actually make them in um, and I just figured because I'm using a hot plate uh, it might cook a little bit better so I'll just turn this down a little bit and I'm hoping the heat oh yeah yeah that's getting warm I've... so I've got my mar my salmon marinating in there and um, what's in there is um, What's the sauce? A uh, tablespoon of uh, lemon zest, which I, I've pre-prepared this before. Uh, lemon zest, garlic, uh, probably a tablespoon of garlic, um, minced. Uh, black pepper, five tablespoons of soy sauce, four tablespoons of dark brown sugar, uh, a couple of tablespoons of water, and some oil. Um, and just mix that up i actually made that yesterday so that's been marinating all day um i just cheated i had to look at my phone for the ingredients sorry um but yeah it's awesome so i'll just let these guys cook a little bit a little get a little bit of heat in there and they're working they're doing what i want so i can see steam coming out so that's awesome um and it'd be easy for me to flip them over too and then i'll get my salmon on um, I'll give you a bit of an update and then I'll show you when it's dished up. Alright, so I've got a bit of a hot heat going on there. Um, these will, I'm going skin down first. This smells super, super nice. Um, I hope the lighting's alright. Um, and yeah, I'll show you an update when I start flipping things over. All right, so I've got my salmon going now. I just actually put a light on so we can see what we're doing. Um, so I'll just let them go. I can see they're nearly half done and my potato gratins in those little tubes, they're working pretty well too. Another caravan's just come in now, so looks like I've got neighbors. Um, and then on the side, I've just got um, some rocket, some cherry toms, um, some pasta salad and some uh, coleslaw. A little bit of extra sauce there, which I'll just throw in. This is Pippi's dinner in here, so um, I will throw that on the heat. So then she thinks she's eating off my plate. What are you doing, my girl? <laughs> boo, boo, boo. All right. Oh, my potato gratins are uh, behaving themselves, so. I actually took the uh, still canisters off. Um, so we're looking pretty good there. Nice bit of juicy juice everywhere. Just sort of smear that up. Salmon's looking good. I wouldn't ordinarily sort of eat salmon normally because it's quite a strong fish. Uh, taste but when you marinate it it's bloody awesome I might flip these now actually yeah she's ready look at that that's looking pretty good now this bad boy doesn't want to stand up boy. Oh. oh I can lay on the side and I've been adding a little bit of more sauce as we go, so not enough, not enough to make the plate go cold, but just to sizzle up a bit. Oh yeah, that's good. I'm happy with that. This is going to taste unreal. Oh, I can hear that sizzling away. Almost ready. All right, dinner's dish. I just need to put a little bit of sexy on there, just to make him look good. But that's it. 
So I got salmon, potato gratins, a um, little bit of greens, cherry toms, and some a um, couple of passes or a little pasta and a uh, coleslaw there. So I'm going to eat well. Awesome. merry morning that was um, I've made that one a little bit strong so I might sit on that for a little while the days turned out pretty good after yesterday's rain um, sun's taken a while to come out clear that clouds are cleared and um, we're looking to have a, a pretty good day I'm just getting brecky ready um, usual suspects Get that going. Pip's going to be my best mate as soon as she works out I've got bacon. Um, shortcut bacon. Um, and yeah. Not much to show you here. We've all seen bacon eggs before. Oh, but I will show you when it's plated up. Always looks good on those plates. Uh, plans for today is to do a lot of nothing. And um, we've already been for a couple of walks. Took a little bit of video might head back down to the dam, lake, spring, whatever you want to call it. And um, yeah, just see what the day brings me. I'll show you when brekkie's done. Oh, there you go. Someone's just realized there's bacon on the pan. Coming along. Won't be long now, just waiting on the eggs. And then it's brekkie time. I'll just pause these legends, Jen and Cal, always enjoy watching you guys. Just getting dinner to ready, so um, I've got some scotch fillets and I've got a cheeky sweet chilli, which I'm going to melt over the steaks. So I've got mushies, uh, broccolini, um, some peas, some onions, uh, a little bit of garlic, some chilli flakes and some pepper, and that's all going to go in there and um, it's gonna be awesome. Had a pretty mellow day today, just sort of sat back, tomorrow I'll leave, uh, a few more crew rocked in. 
um, yeah, went back down to the little dam or lake or stream or whatever they call it. Uh, had a bit of a sticky beak, walked on the little jetty there, that's pretty cool. Um, and yeah, just been listening to podcasts all day. It's all about the Andes, so I need to sort of relax and get my shit together. And so does Poo Poo. Beep, beep, beep. What a good gal. Oh, yeah. Uh, I was listening to, what was I listening to? The Unprofessionals. <laughs> good job, guys. And um, the Tinsman, enjoy their podcast too. So, anyway, so I'll get this going um, and I'll show you along the way. Where's that red button? About there. Right, so I've got the green beans in there with the onion. I'll just mix these up and um, I'll put them aside until I'm ready for them. I just want them sort of al dente. Um, there's what's in there there's pepper there's chili flakes and there's curry no garlic garlic paste garlic <laughs> what's in there garlic powder uh -huh. all right start that for Ron all right I've just chucked in two scotch fillets in there I'll put nothing on there other than pepper and a bit of oil so I'll turn those a couple of times, let them go, and um, then I'll throw me uh, chili sauce on top. Alright, so my two scotch fillets are in there, my broccolini, my mushrooms, um, and the chili dip, creamy chili dip. If it doesn't taste good, it's going to bloody look good. <laughs> Super excited about this. Yum yum. Job done. Check this out. Oh yeah. So I've got my steak, onions, mushrooms, broccolini, um, sweet peas, onions, with a combination of the like peppers and curry, everything, or oh, chili, and a bit of goon on the side. So I reckon that's pretty good. Awesome, I'm gonna eat well tonight. So it's Pippi. Bloody coffee morning. It's always the way. The day you leave becomes a stunner. The sun's going up now, so I'm just getting ready uh, to leave. Had a pretty good sleep, but I got up early this morning. Um, there you go. Yeah. Paper, bu paper Bark Creek. Hip Camp's pretty good. Good for kids. They can ride their bikes and all that. The ground's pretty firm here. There's plenty of area to kick a footy and all that. And the little lake or stream. There's a bonus. You can swim in that. There's little tiny fish and all that in there too. So, all good. Well, that's it for another one. Cheers for watching. Cheers to all the new subscribers. And I guess I'll see you on the next one. <laughs>